Hello, everyone. Welcome to my channel. This week, China has released a great video of the Y-20 transport aircraft, showing the large aircraft in action at night. I already shared a few Y-20 videos. The Y-20 has carried out a large number of overseas missions in 2022, which has made a great breakthrough for the Chinese military in both strategic and technical aspects. For example, in the first half of this year, the Y-20 made a disaster relief mission to the South Pacific Island nation of Tonga. Since then, a few Y-20 have flown to Serbia to deliver the FK-3 air defense missile systems. That was the first European mission by Chinese military transport aircraft. In addition, the Y-20 flies to African countries such as Mali to carry out peacekeeping missions. Recently, the Y-20 traveled to Austria to take part in a local air show. In the past, the Chinese Air Force's transport fleet had been largely confined to domestic operations. But with the introduction of large transport aircraft, this situation has improved. These missions across oceans and continents pose a obvious challenge to the performance, reliability, and the crew of the Y-20. We can all see that the Y-20 large transport aircraft and its crew have proven their ability. The strategic projection capability of the Chinese Air Force is very clear now. This has certainly caught the attention of many Western countries. Interestingly, even though the Y-20 appeared in an air show in Austria, but the coverage in the West is very limited. I don't want to speculate what caused this, Maybe some Western media are reluctant to touch this topic, which can be understandable. And finally, thanks for watching my video. I hope you can subscribe, share, and comment on my videos. Thank you.